Hello, welcome back. Another episode of Sex Education. We're on season four, episode three. I am excited. I had just <laughs> watched the last episode. Well, I watched it, had breakfast. I was sitting at, <laughs> eating my breakfast and I was like, this is annoying because it's so good. Like I've been, I'm enjoying this season that I was like, I want to put it on while I'm watching. Like I want to keep like consuming this show. And I was like, I don't know what to watch. You know, you got to find that perfect like <laughs> thing to watch while you're eating. And this would have been it. But I was like, ah, oh, I got to record it. So I like ate my breakfast really quickly. And I was like, well, and then I'll come straight back and start watching it because I'm having a good time. I want to see all, where all the plot lines go. I want to see. You know, I want, I, I want to finish this season because it's sad. I want to know how it ends. Like, I don't know. It, I'm enjoying it just so much. <laughs> That's all I can say, really. Um, but if you'd like to watch the full-length reactions, I have a link to my Patreon down below. Like and subscribe. That would be fantastic. And let's get into it. I should bring the special pants. Shh. No, oh, my God. It hasn't happened okay. She wet the bed. Oh, my God. Is she going to see O? Love you. Oh my god. Again, Ruby. Oh, poor Ru oh, The more they give us backstory of M Ruby and more character development, I love her. Look after it, Sarah? Hi. This is an interesting place for camp. Ew. Can anyone smell something bad? It's oh god. Yeah, poor people always stink. <laughs> oh, Jesus. These kids are brutal. Ah, that's Darla. She doesn't like anyone in her group. Yeah. She seems awful. Do you want to have a boat competition? Okay, is this O? <laughs> oh, this is cute. Why the hell are all these little girls so mean? <laughs> Oh my god, poor people always smell bad? What the hell? Jesus. And I gotta know, are rich people always rude assholes? I guess that's the stereotype for you, little miss. Don't tell anyone. I won't. Yeah, she's not a bitch <laughs> like all the other people here. All you gotta do is tick the box to say my name. Oh my god, she's like, I will destroy you because you don't remember me at all. Ugh, I love Ruby. <laughs> Ruby, Amy, Maeve, ugh. Oh. So, I, is Ola and, like, um, oh my god, what's her name? Lily and Jakob just, like, not in this season? Don't you think I should wear something a bit more formal? No, you want to be professional. It is great. You could be anyone. Which means Amazing. People can project what they want onto you. Oh my god, she's a genius. I love her. And yes, it was better than what you were wearing. I just didn't think the, um, the lavender matched well with your, like, made you look very pale. I don't need that, do you? Maybe a little bit. <laughs> your skin looks like an onion, Otis. Just a little. Just a little. We can all use a little touch-up here and there. Amazing. All glammed. Thank you, Ruby. I love it how she jingles everywhere she goes. Oh my god, he looks like someone's held him captive. Should I start? Have you talked about what you're gonna say? Actually, I am Otis Milburn and I'm here to say. Oh no! Today, cuts. What the hell are you doing? Yeah, we didn't want a song. We didn't want a song. Interesting and mysterious. Yeah, that was hell. You are none of those things. Yeah, you have to. Invite us in. Need a clean message, which is why which... I've made your script. That's a long script. And be normal. Yes, we want to see you. You know, you invite us in with your calm normalness. Now, forget the camera. Forget the script. Pretend I'm a client. Yes, amazing. Why I should listen to you? You need to do a one-on-one. -on -one. The camera is not your place to shine, and it doesn't have to be. Oh no, is he gonna like... Okay. Good job, Otis. Hi, I'm Otis Milburn, and I'm running for a student counsellor. 
Oh my god, thank god he dropped that w voice he does. Mess. I am incredibly awkward and I struggle with public speaking. Yeah, and this is why you're so good. I've had my yeah. heart broken by people I like and I've hurt people who like me. Yeah, amen. Sorry, Ruby. Oh no, I don't want to cry. <laughs> Every episode I'm going to say it at least once. I am a mess, but I think all teenagers are. Oh, yeah. It's so important. God, it was hell for everyone. See, that was nice. We connected. Oh no, Ruby connected. I almost died when giving birth. Yeah, that was. <sighs> that was a very stressful. Get to meet my baby or see my son again. If you got to see me during that instance, I was. They also just cut like that was not given as much time as it needed in that. In that season, I was so stressed. I'm like, she's fucking hemorrhaging. I'm crying. And then they kind of just cut away. I was like, you can't cut away. Is she dead? Oh, I was so worried. Don't do much. Left foot. That's your right foot. No. Don't take the judgmental tone. We want to have a good experience. Oh, is he learning how to drive like a, a manual? Stop. You didn't teach me how to stop. Other. You didn't tell me how to stop. Oh my god. Oh my god. Trying to be a better me. Yeah, please, please say your mottos. I didn't teach you how to stop. It's my fault. I am sorry I yelled. Yeah, but that you also did have a crash, and that is stressful. It's freaking me out. I'm <laughs> doing an online course. It's called being a better man. Fantastic. I'm happy. Please. I mean, I can see how hard he's trying, but he's also such a dick. <laughs> like, I want I want him to get where he wants to go. I really do. I'm a second chance person. <laughs> oh my god, he slept with the wrong sister! <laughs> They're way more compatible. I was gay for about a week when I was 15. <laughs> I saw this okay. film with Clint Eastwood. Thanks, Michael. That's cute. Thinking about him carrying a gun. Interesting. Is it maybe I just wanted to be Clint Eastwood and not have sex with him? What a nice... <laughs> what a nice story. This course you're doing is making me really weird. <laughs> no, it's nice. He's not yelling at you as much. Uh, it was cool. Yeah. That we weren't friends anymore. I thought maybe he'd want to talk about it. That's so nice. Oh, I, I love a redemption arc. Come on, Michael. Yeah, it's okay if he doesn't want to talk. It was hard. Yeah, and you guys are both bad at talking, so it makes it good. It hurt as much as it did. Yeah, every day... Everything feels a little bit better. I'm okay. He's a bisexual. <laughs> a bisexual? He is bisexual. You know, they say that Alexander the Great may have been bisexual. <laughs> the weirdest responses, but I love it. <laughs> you know, if it's not something assholey, it's fine. <laughs> well, he does love history. I'm pretty sure that's right. So it's cool. When I got sad as a kid, I'd bury all my mum's jewellery in the garden so she couldn't find it. Probably <laughs> still there, actually. You're a maverick. A very rich person way of doing it, but I love it. it means that you don't think like other people. I thought that was being stupid. <laughs> You're your own no, person. it's... I, who cares? Either either, it's still fun. Oh, are they gonna go in for a kiss? Do you have any of those cakes there? Yeah, loads. Have them all. <laughs> Amy's like, I'm freaking the fuck out. <laughs> you go. You'll go. Can what you did they get speak there? or something? Oh, God. <laughs> Never have I ever wet the bed on school camp. <laughs> oh, no. You threw her under the bus. Under a mattress. Oh, 
Oh, what the fuck? I thought you were nice. Oh my god, I would strangle her. They put the video online so everyone found out. I'd be so mad. You know, yeah, this is personal. And being bullied can easily contribute to nocturnal aneurysis. Oh, I it's don't really need you to. <laughs> right now. Is yeah, this... just. I've got it under control. Obviously. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you spoke with someone. And also, we're here for revenge, babes. Get on board. Hell. Anyway, it was the weird girl with the weird parents whose mum made her clothes, and I didn't think it could get yeah. worse. And then this happened. Oh God! But we're gonna get revenge now, cause we're cool. For, I don't. I can't tell. Like, a where do they live? B. I thought it was like a small town. How are there this many queer people? <laughs> no, queer people are everywhere. Don't get me wrong. But I'm just like, I thought they lived in the middle of nowhere with, like, a town of, like, a hundred people. <laughs> like, where are these people? I need to know on a map, geogra geographically, where they and everyone else is. If it makes you feel any better, I wasn't really there to hang out with anyone with the other seat. Oh no, have they dumped you? Made loads of new friends. Oh god. And they don't have time to see me. Oh, that's... <sighs> Ruby! Why does my heart break for her, like, every 10 seconds? Stop talking, my sis. You're ruining the episode. Oh. I'm glad I put her in S tier. On my tier list. I really am. She deserves to be up there. She could even get bumped up a little. Bronte thinks... I'm not sure you're cut out to be a writer. Excuse you? If Tyrone enjoyed it. Writing is a very tough business, so I wouldn't want you to get your hopes up. David. Or Mr. Malloy. Fuck you, man. Thanks for reading it. Oh, he does bitchy asshole very well. But you suck. P poor Maeve. P poor Maeve. No, you can't fuck. Don't you dare. Screw you, man. This is a fun little... This is a fun night. This looks like full of, like, so much enjoyment. I feel like Lily would like this, but apparently they don't... Oh! What the hell is happening here? Okay. Did we... What did we... Have we done anything? Or did we just fall asleep watching the fake Real Housewives? The third... The third wives of the Real Houses. Um, usually, you know, both eyes closed. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Well, it's okay. You know, it's good to get your, your hours up. Sorry about it. You just fell asleep. Yeah, technically, that's not that bad. You did spoon a little. Yeah. Let's meet up tomorrow morning and... Like... Thank you, Ruby. I'm, I just don't want Ruby to get hurt again if she falls for him. Maeve. Just let her know that you're feeling left behind. Yeah, agreed. Being honest is the best part. Ugh, oh, I love Ruby. Thanks, Lily. I hope she gets a friend. Like, we're her friend. Otis is her friend, but I hope she'll find someone in this season. Because I need her to have a good arc, or I'm going to feel very unresolved, and it will kill me. Oh, God. You don't okay? <laughs> You doing okay, Eric? You look a little tired, to say the least. Head throbbing. Oh, oh, no, don't. don't. <laughs> I don't. Oh, I didn't want to see that. Yikes. Oh my god. Yeah, it seems kind of annoying. Oh, Jean. Oh, everything's being a bit much. Oh, she's sick of hearing the baby cry. 
Oh my god, everyone's got so much to think about. Holy shit. That's what I like about this show is no one's no one's like perfect or a good character. Everyone's so complicated, like everything's fucked, everything's going on. Like it's very real, I feel. Oh, what happened to her brother? Oh. Mummy's in hospital. She found evidence. Oh no. Come home. I mean, we're happy you're coming home, but Jesus, Aaron. Oh, okay. Yeah, like, it's it's the thing I like about this show is is a lot of it's very serious and very hard and there are real things and there's so many like perspective and thoughts and it's just I love the roller coaster it sends me on and and how much I do like after four seasons like you you do care <laughs> you do care so much for these characters I just want to see them all like come out at the end so well and I love all the different bits and and how they're figuring things out and they're all navigating their lives and I want everyone to, uh, like the best to be for everyone but there's so many things that need to be resolved and they're all going through so many things and they they all just need to open up a little and need a little bit more help but oh god I just want everything to be good in the end oh, I am loving I'm in love with this season I'm like I don't know I just I think it really helped watching the first three seasons like re-watching them just before watching this because I I feel like I'm consumed by it so I'm really in the mood to be watching it therefore I'm loving it so much uh but yeah I'm, I'm having a great time I really hope you are too I hope you're enjoying and are having a great day and I hope to see you in the next one